back to the banks, but is Greece moving back from the brink? Some branches were open today for pensioners who don't have debit cards, but they were limited to 120 euros each. This man said, today I went to withdraw part of my pension. I worked for 40 years and now I've ended up begging for money. Another argued, this is not enough for me to help with my grandchildren. I have six, this will not be enough for them. It is senior citizens, though, who could hold part of the key to a new deal, because Greece now says delaying a rise in the pension age and other compromises like lower VAT for its islands could lead to a funding agreement. But this afternoon, Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras made it clear a planned referendum on bailout options this weekend will go ahead, saying the popular vote is more important than government decisions. The latest Greek proposals were outlined in this letter sent by the PM today as the rest of Europe ponders the ripple effect of the country's crisis, including the governor of the Bank of England on the outlook here. As risks associated with Greece began to crystallize in recent days, that outlook has worsened. UK authorities will continue to monitor developments closely and will take any actions required to safeguard financial stability in the United Kingdom. Back in Athens, there is no sense of stability, just stalemate, with fresh protests today outside the finance ministry, where these pensioners called for a vote against more austerity. But their referendum is still days away. Peter Lane, 5 News.